Hello, this is Sheba from financetrain.com. In this video, I will discuss how to calculate the net present value of a project. The net present value is the most commonly used measure used to decide whether to invest in a project or not. The net present value of a project is equal to the sum of the present value of all after-tax cash flows from the project minus the initial investment. So what we are essentially saying is that if the project will earn us so much money in each of the coming years, what will be the value of that money earned in today's terms? So we will get the present value of the future cash flows from the business. We know how much we have invested in the business. So NPV is the difference between these two. The investment decision using the NPV method will be based on whether the NPV is positive or negative. The NPV will be positive if the present value of all future earning is more than the money invested. A positive NPV indicates that the project is worth investing in. On the other hand, a negative NPV indicates that investing in the project will not be wise. The formula on screen is used to calculate the NPV of a project. The numerator represents the cash flow at time t. R represents the discount rate chosen to calculate the present value. This is also the desired rate from the project. T represents the number of periods for which we will receive the cash flows. Let's take a simple example to illustrate the calculation of NPV. Assume that your company is looking at investing $100 million in a capital project. The project will return post-tax cash flow of $30 million for three years and $50 million for the fourth year. Assume a discount rate of 10%. As you can see, the present value of all future cash flows is $108.76 million after considering a desired rate of 10%. This investment can be done for $100 million today. The wealth of the investor will increase by $8.76 million. Therefore, the investor should invest in this project. Thank you. Visit Finance Trade.